Hello, Mayor Graham. How are you today? Pretty good, pretty good. I, I couldn't have been any happier to hear somebody else that's complaining about the Watertown Daily Times. In the last, and I paid particular attention, the last probably two months of the North Country local section, and there is absolutely zero, I shouldn't say zero, a, a page and a half of local news. And I'm sure there's more than a page and a half of local news happening in northern New York. And a point I'd like to bring up is, as is the River Hospital had their opening at the uh, for the, uh, the the new war that they've put together after it got stripped out from the previous owner, and not one journalist down there for this ceremony. Uh, and, and Channel Seven, Channel Seven could not even be bothered. They showed up the day before. Uh, I'm just I'm just totally disgusted with, and I'm totally unhappy with with the way that the Watertown Daily Times is is has put stuff together. It's 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 ludicrous. It's it's just too bad that our local newspaper can't report on on some other stuff besides just heartbreak in families. Well, uh, yeah, but I don't see that. You know, I know of families that are have been broken up and have heartbreak, and there's some. In very dire circumstances. I don't even prominent families. It generally doesn't get reported on. But it just it, there, we just don't get. There's got to be more than a page and a half of news in Jefferson, St. Lawrence, and Lewis County. I could care less. Who and I don't. And I think probably the majority of the people in North Country could care less about somebody dying out in California or or somebody got robbed in 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 Albany. In the North Country section, put in the state section. I don't want to. I want to see what's going on in Northern New York. I, I don't want to see what's going on in Albany in the Northern New York section. Mm -hmm. Okay. I guess that's my spin on it. I was just totally unhappy that 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 Channel Seven and W or that Watertown Crimes couldn't couldn't be at at the at the Bay Hospital for that opening. I thought that was just tragic that that such such an event that those people have, have worked so hard to do. And, and put together a new OR down there, and in our own local, people right. couldn't even be there. Channel Ten was there. Nick a Darling was there. Amy Oler was she there? But where? But where was? Where was? Where was? Where was her own stay at Watertown well, Station? I don't, I don't know. I, I, you know, I do know from being in the business. And listen, I am a frequent uh, critic of some of the assignment decisions made, but um, it is not possible to cover everything. And sometimes you make judgments, uh, saying, well, we're, now, the judgments may not always be correct, or they're certainly open to interpretation, but you can't be everywhere covering everything. And, um, I don't know, I, just in defense of media. And uh, I'd be the first one to say if they made a mistake. Yeah. But I, I agree. I, I, You know, some of the decisions are suspect, but they're always going to be. And you go to any city. You go to Syracuse. Syracuse is a... Uh, you know, the, the, those type of things don't get reported in the Post Standard. Well, I just, I just think that that there's more going on in Northern New York than than, than we get a page and a half of news on. You know, you buy you buy the paper, you buy the Sunday paper. You can read it in 20 minutes and be done, and line the garbage can with it because that's all it's all that's left that's any good for it. Mm -hmm. But well, anyways, that's okay. Well, thank you. <laughs> anyway, congratulations up in the Bay. Anyway, okay. I think that's the guy who plays Santa Claus every year at Bonnie Castle's Christmas party. I'm not sure. but uh, Sorry to uh, note the passing of Gordy Cole, uh, supervisor down in uh, Rodman. I, is he, was he supervisor at the time of his death, town supervisor? Uh, he may have been. I know he was in that office for a lot of years. But uh, Gordon passed away over the weekend, and uh, certainly... Uh, Saddened about that. He did a lot of different things too. He was in the Air Force. Wasn't he a trooper? I'm not sure what he was, but he was he certainly active in his community, and uh, we lament his passing. All righty, seven five five twelve forty is the phone number. We'll be back with more in a moment. Be listening.